It's a bit of a step back in time. And people tell us it smells like a hardware store, too, when they walk in. Authentic. That's the Detroit Hardware Company. The floors are wood and to this day expand and contract depending on the humidity level present in the building. The original tin ceilings remain as well. This vintage scale still measures up and the sturdy wood bins that hold the nails, screws, and bolts have also stood the test of time. After 89 years in business, much remains the same at Detroit Hardware Company, starting with the service customers receive. You can come in and kind of describe what you want, even if you don't know what it's called, and we will figure it out. That's, that's, what, we, that's what we do. You need paint? They've got it. Tools? Check. Housewares and household products? Well, they stock those as well blinds, drill bits, uh, screws, uh, you name it, I've purchased it here <laughs> for rent signs, a little bit of everything. This is the way the store looked back in 1947. As the business grew, retail space was added on the second floor and the expansion continued into the adjacent building. Emily Webster's family co-owns the store. She's been working here since she was in high school. Many neighborhood hardware stores in the city closed long ago, but Detroit Hardware Company continues to fill the needs of the new center community. If I can get something in 15 minutes versus taking a half an hour ride, then I'd rather get it around the corner in 15 minutes and get back to the actual work, which is what this is all about. We're here for what you need and when you need it.